And you may not realize that today is call of the horizon day where we look out to see the beauty that is on the horizon. Well, maybe retirement is on your horizon and you want to make it as beautiful as possible. And that's the reason that we check in each and every week with Lauren Merkel from Merkel Retirement Planning to find out how to make your retirement just that much better. Hey, Lauren, how are you? I'm doing good, Lou. Thank you. How are you today? We are doing great. Now, a lot of people think about retirement and right away they think about age 65 and that comes to mind. But we've been talking uh, most recently about some different ages when you should really start considering retirement. And the one we're going to talk about today, I think is going to get a lot of attention. Yeah, we've talked about a couple different ages on this show, Lou. We've talked about 65, as you mentioned. We talked about 63 and a half and how that's important in today's retirement landscape. We talked about 72. Today, it's about 59 and a half. And 59 and a half is a time that a lot of people do celebrate because what it does is it gives you access to your 401k plan money. It not only gives you access to your 401k plan money where you can take it out and not have to pay a 10% penalty if you need it, want it for income, but even if you're currently working with your employer, putting money into your 401k plan, most 401k plans today offer you the ability to take that money out shift it over into your own account underneath your IRA, not have to pay taxes on that transfer. And now underneath the IRA, you have control over it where you can invest it any way you want to, almost literally. And now you can structure your IRA or your the majority of your retirement money in a, in a lot different way than what you're limited to underneath your employer plan. But I think the important thing you mentioned is that you say you took the money and you rolled it over into the other plans. That is essential, isn't it? It is essential because that way you don't pay taxes on that rollover. So you don't pay taxes on it once it gets into the IRA, then it continues to grow tax deferred. Now you still make contributions to your 401k plan. So what we're talking about, Lou, here is how you make the best, how you use the best of both worlds. The 401k plan is designed for your new contributions because you can contribute more to the 401k plan than your IRA. Also, most employers have a match. So if you contribute, you get free money from the employer. That's a really good thing. The IRA is designed to, to house your retirement wealth. So, cause you have more control over it underneath the IRA. So in this structure, you're using the 401k plan for new contributions, using the IRA to house your retirement wealth. And it's a win-win for your entire portfolio. Well, I'm sure there's a lot of people out there that just simply don't want to touch their 401k. They've heard so many stories about that. Is there ever a time when you really just want to take the money and just leave it where it is? Yes, of course, there are some exceptions. One of the exceptions is if you plan on retiring or if you're, you get separated from your employer between the ages of 55 and 59 and a half. Because let's say you're 56 years old, you get separated from your employer, you can take money from the employer plan and not pay the 10% penalty. You can take the money from the employer plan, use it for anything you want to and not pay the 10% penalty. You will still have to pay taxes on the pre-tax money just not the 10% penalty. If you were to roll that money over to the IRA, now you have to wait until 59 and a half to take it out and use it for income to live on. So that's an important exception to, to what we're talking about here today. It sounds like there's a lot of different rules that apply when you're moving your finances around, you're moving your money around like this. And uh, this would be something ideal to sit down and have a conversation with your folks with, uh, isn't it? Yeah, there's a lot of rules around it, and these rules do change quite a bit. We have legislative changes that take place all the time. So we want to make sure that your retirement plan does account for the current rules, also uh, future legislative changes as well. So yes, uh, it's very simple to talk to a retirement player, planner here at Merkle Retirement Planning. You can go to Merkle. Uh, retirementplan.com, sign up for a complimentary retirement plan review and uh, talk with a retirement planner about uh, really anything that's concerning around your retirement. Uh, Lou, with this 59 and a half age, we did an entire 30 minute show that we have out on our YouTube page. So if people want to see a lot more detail around 59 and a half and even some of these other ages, they can go out to YouTube, type the Merkle Retirement Planning, and we have a whole show that's dedicated to this topic. See, I'm glad you mentioned the YouTube channel because uh, your YouTube channel, Merkle Retirement Planning, you have over 100 different videos that are on there. We were looking at them last week. And uh, really, you touch on all the subjects that we have touched on on this program. 
Yeah, we have a 30-minute show that plays every weekend, and we put all of those shows out on the YouTube channel so you can watch it at your leisure, and you can uh, pick and choose which topics are most important to you because we have, have them all itemized out there by topic. All right, and if people want to get more information on anything that we talked about here today or maybe set up a plan like that or maybe get involved in one of the workshops that you have coming up in the near future, what's the best place they can go? It's very simple. Go to MerkelPlan.com, MerkelPlan.com. You can sign up for any of that. Uh, those events that we have. All right, sounds great. Well, Laura Merkel, you have yourself a great weekend and we will talk again on Monday. And Monday, we're going to talk about yet another age that people can celebrate when thinking about retirement. Can't wait, Lou. Have a great weekend.